Fairtrade Airways, low cost carrier, who's in the process of being bought out by its rivalry, Southwest Airlines, for the price tag of $1.4 billion, has left local and state law leaders in a bit of a shock. With written contracts in hand, government subsidies built a new systems operations center for AirTran and came in exchange for promises that would keep the airline in its headquarters in Orlando and add 120 new jobs in Central Florida by 2016. Few details have been worked out in the merger, which could take up to two years to complete. One clear change, however, will be the relocation of AirTran's headquarters in Orlando to Southwest Dallas Base. Even though AirTran promised in writing that it will maintain its headquarters here in Orlando, now here's a breakdown of where the money has come from. Three million dollars from the state of Florida. One point seven million dollars from the Greater Orlando Aviation Authority, the company which runs the airport. A hundred and eighty-six thousand dollars from the city of Orlando and seven hundred thousand dollars from an undisclosed source. Now state and local leaders are left trying to figure out how to salvage or recoup up to five point four million dollars in taxpayers money from AirTran's broken promises. Steve Paulser, CSB News 9.